let's solve this equation. It looks like this one's pretty fancy too, eh? We have the variable is occurring more than once, we have some distributive property in there, but just like any other kind of equation, the goal is going to be to unwrap the present, to isolate the variable. So in this one, I think I'm going to choose to distribute the variable, the 7 through the v plus 5 first. So let's see, distributing, distributing this through would give 7v, that's 7 times v, 7 times 5 would be 35, and then the rest of the problem just kind of stays the same, minus 5v equals 17. Now, on the left hand side, there's a 7v and a 5v, so we're going to collect those like terms. 7v minus 5 v yields 2v, and then we still have this plus 35, so I'm going to just rewrite that piece, and then we still have that this equals 17, equals 17. Okay, and now we're down to a standard two-step equation. We're going to have to cancel out or eliminate the adding of 35, which would be done with its inverse operation, and the inverse of addition is subtraction is the inverse operation. So 35 and 35 are gone. 2v is left over. 17 minus 35 would be negative 18. And then last step would be to divide by 2. And after dividing by 2 it looks like we get a v and negative 18 divided by 2 would be negative 9. So the final solution is v equals negative 9. Uh, since this is kind of a shorter video, let's check this just for fun. So as a check, what would I get as a check? 7, negative 9, plus 5, minus 5 times negative 9. This is the left-hand side. So 7, negative 4, Minus 5 times negative 9 would be minus a negative 45. And then we get a negative 28, and minusing a negative would be adding 45. And what do we get there? It looks like about positive 17, I think. 